Does it work? Yes, it works. All right, perfect. Hi there, and welcome to my How to Creative channel. My name is Felix, and in this specific video, we're going to discuss if a mechanical keyboard is any good. I received it one week ago, and I did an unboxing and everything. Sadly, the microphone was not on. Hmm. But after that, I tried it for a week, and I thought maybe I should give you guys an update and a video on what are the advantages and what are the like less good points about having a mechanical keyboard. It's an RGB color light, everything. It's a little bit dusty because I had it there for a week. Yeah. This specific one is RGB. Um, so yeah, throw the box away. So this was my previous one. I actually glow in the dark. Um, finish that I put over it, but it got really filthy and everything because, yeah, the keyboards get filthy. This one is a regular Microsoft keyboard. It's it's not very specific. It's it's all right, um, but I thought I, I should replace it. And I found this amazing keyboard for I think a fifty dollars or fifty euros on, on on AliExpress. And what personally I really dig about the keyboard is that. It's so, it feels so good, it's so accurate. And you can just change the color to which one you like. And in my opinion, that's great. Um, I've been rocking the cyan until now. I think that's like the light blue. It's one of my, my favorite colors and it works really well with the RGB in the background as you can see here as well. What I really like about this RGB is that it awesomely lights up in the dark. Uh, I will show you a little clip or that I made in during the night, how the, the, the keys actually look. So let's do that first. So this keyboard is really nice to use because it has uh, an unmistakable uh, feedback response. So if you press it, you only get the feedback when it's halfway in. And normally when you slightly press a key, it already uh, gives a response in the computer. So for this specific keyboard, the motor speed uh, CK108, you can get uh, the blue switch or the black switch. The blue switch is really loud and heavy. That's incredibly loud, I know. <laughs> and the black switch is heavy, but really quiet. So if you cannot handle the, the, the really clicky sound, you can always go for the black switch. This tool, which also came in the package um, that you can use to get the keys off. See, that's how easy it is. And you can even clean the keyboard uh, without damaging your keyboard at all. So you have three different kind of switches. You have linear, tactile, and clicky. The normal color switches are red, blue, brown, black, and transparent. All right, so that's it for now. Thank you for watching this video, and I hope you got a little information from this review. Um, whether your decision will be to buy this mechanical keyboard, or to switch to a mechanical keyboard, or uh, stick to your old one, or maybe you already have one. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.